My name is Dasya Sainz and I'm in the MCDM, Masters of Communication and Digital Media program with Scott. Um, so my idea is uh, sort of a riff on this notion of taking shortcuts and how we all kind of feel like we've got the best shortcut mm -hmm. around traffic. Uh, people get like to get in, you know, little matches about squabs about whose whose route is actually quicker. And I, and, and actually, I don't think anyone is is actually gonna save any time. But I think the the main part about it is that it makes us feel better about evading traffic, and it makes us feel like we're being proactive in a way. So uh, my concept is shortcuts, creative uses of traffic in Seattle. Uh, so this is uh, the mission here is to address commuter frustrations with traffic by sparking a dialogue and a conversation with coping mechanisms within the community uh, through the social media channels that uh, WashDOT has in place already through Facebook and Twitter. So I've made sort of a PSA, but I'm gonna call it a PEA, a public engagement announcement, not so much a public service announcement. So it's this platform basically to just get people talking about the things that they can do uh, the, whether it be literally a route, that, you know, routes that you take that that make you feel like you're getting around congested areas in a more timely manner, or just mainly like how you're spending that time, um, and, and and not letting giving into your frustrations. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a lot of time spent in traffic, so um, I'm just gonna go ahead and play it. And then the clouds roll by and time speeds past, and you, you're getting nowhere. Take matters into your own hands. Introducing shortcuts, creative uses of traffic in Seattle. Get around that congestion with your top secret super stealth backwash. Escape into those epic worlds tucked away in your audiobooks. Learn that language you haven't dusted off since high school. Est-ce que vous voudriez boire quelque chose avec moi ce soir? Traffic sucks. The time is yours. Get creative. What's your shortcut? So, uh, so here's the thing. When I first came up with this, I got real excited. I was like, oh my god, there's so much you could get done in all of that time that you're sitting in traffic. But really, when you really start uh, boiling it down, uh, it's, a, it's kind of a fine line to walk. We don't want to uh, promote distracted drivers, but we do want to encourage uh, people to, you know, think of ways that they can exercise their agency to get to their happy place instead of being angry and having a lot of road rage. And more important, it's about that conversation and get, getting people, whether it's an avenue to vent or to really share good ideas on what they can do. So I started thinking about all the different things that people could do in this time, and really, for me, I feel like it boils down to um, it's got to be auditory in order to still stay focused on driving. So I thought, you know, books on tape uh, are a great way of learning a new language, uh, catching up on all of those episodes of This American Life, that there are so many of them. And so this could lead maybe to a possible, possible partnerships with uh, audible.com or Berlitz, like some sort of, uh, you know, language platform. Uh, PBS, maybe even just to do some cross promoting to help spread the word, to help WashDOT get the word out that they've got social media, because I think that's something that's, you know, could help. Uh, and then I also thought maybe, you know, you could practice karaoke. And if that was the case, you know, could we get together with Microsoft and come up with some sort of like sing along karaoke game? Uh, but more importantly, like if you just go to WashDOT's website, you don't really see a lot of, of like, of a space or an opportunity for people to come together and talk about those things, or just you know some here's some examples of like what you can do to, to 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 cope. Because the fact is is like with all of the construction that's going on, it's like it's not going to get better for a long before it's going to get worse before it gets better. And I think you know we can try to encourage people to be patient, but that can almost feel more enraging when you're stuck in traffic. So it's like how can we shift that focus uh, from you know that's not going to go away. So make it better, right?